Hi, today we are going to see what are all the Windows monitoring tools available to monitor the Windows Server. Uh, there are various tools available. The first one is uh, Event Viewer. To find the Event Viewer, type uh, click Windows button and type Event Viewer. Um, if you go Event Viewer, uh, you, you can see this type of Windows appear here. Uh, there are various logs available uh, there are custom logs and uh, windows logs and uh, click a uh, windows log under this windows log category you will find uh, application log security log and system log all those logs are available to monitor the windows uh, to see the windows what went wrong and what windows is thinking so if you go to application log you will find uh, if there is uh, any application uh, uh, category error or if there is a information or if there is an error happening you will find all those information under this category under this system category you will find all those uh, uh, system related uh, errors and system related warnings even if you can't understand uh, any of this you just copy paste all those information into the google uh, search uh, you will find lot of blogs and uh, even uh, microsoft blogs available to uh, see what error have what error it occurred all those uh, information will be available in microsoft sites itself and uh, there are date and time stamps uh, when exactly it happened all those information available under this uh, windows event viewer category the second category of uh, monitoring tools is uh, very useful uh, many people are already used it's a task manager under this task manager you can see not only the system uh, uh, application performance uh, you can see the server performance also whether the server meets the hardware requirements over the time or the application installed you can uh, go under the performance tag and you can see uh, how much cpu it's utilized how much memory is utilized uh, if there is a, a network traffic uh, heavy network traffic all those informations available under this category right now the not much uh, happening uh, uh, under my cpu uh, but if there is a lot of application running if there is a ad server running uh, then it will uh, it will give a lot of uh, information under this uh, there is a performance monitor if you need uh, more granular information uh, you can go this uh, uh, a performance monitor category and click one of the site it will give more granular information about what's happening uh, inside the computer or uh, what's happening inside the memory all those details will be available using this task manager category the third one is a uh, windows performance monitor you can go under uh, uh, you can type a performance monitor in windows uh, category and uh, you can see this type of windows uh, if you want more uh, detailed information about what's happening and in inside your windows server uh, this is the best uh, uh, to analyze the information so to uh, know how to uh, operate this just click the uh, plus button and add which one you want to monitor there are a lot of information like a processor not only processor ram hardware thing there are software thing also you can monitor under this uh, performance monitor category uh, you can either select one disk or you can uh, select multiple disk or multiple uh, ethernet interfaces all those uh, things are available under this performance monitor category for example i'm adding a uh, this memory category all those full memory uh, what are all available features available you, you can see all those uh, information under this uh, category if you want to modify one of the you know uh, the graph uh, you can uh, do that by selecting uh, one of the color uh, changing the color or thickness of the uh, button you can change that using the uh, performance monitor category the next tool uh, we are going to see is uh, it's not available in windows uh, itself you have to download it and install it it's called windows message analyzer after 2016 windows windows server 2016 uh, microsoft introduced this message uh, windows message analyzer using this message analyzer it's similar to wireshark uh, category but it's a uh, microsoft windows product it will give more information regarding what's going on in the network uh, 
uh, Windows network and what's going on in the Windows server all those things if you want to analyze um, you have to use this Windows message analyzer um, to launch uh, this Windows analyzer uh, it's better to launch in uh, uh, administrator privilege so that it will uh, uh, collect all those administrator information also uh, privileged information also um, you can uh, monitor everything using this uh, thing uh, for example you can monitor the local area network or you can monitor uh, uh, HTTPS secure information what's uh, happening inside your network for example I'm clicking this uh, local area it will start a new session and uh, for example if I I'll open a browser and uh, type uh, google.com or something like that so it will try to contact the dns server outside uh, area from this server and it will uh, resolve those informations um, if you want uh, where it is uh, uh, those information how it's contacted how many bits all those information is available um, using this for example uh, see when I open the browser it started it connecting to the Bing uh, network so how many bits and uh, which DNS server it contacted all those informations are available uh, using this so this is the uh, information it contacted and if you scroll down a little bit uh, uh, let me scroll down a little bit see this is a google.com that uh, we just type and uh, you can see uh, all those detailed information about uh, uh, what time and uh, uh, when it's contacted uh, how many bytes are sent over this network to that network all those information not only this uh, local server information if you want to uh, uh, monitor the whole entire network uh, in your windows computer you can monitor that also using this uh, windows message analyzer tool so these are the four monitoring tools available in windows server and you can use this um, to benefit what's going on in the windows if you want detailed videos uh, please uh, let me know in the comment section i can post detailed video of each one of each one of the categories